Cape Town, so a brand new location for Formula E. I think it's probably the, the track that I was the most uh, excited to come to. A very high speed circuit, which is quite different to some of the other tracks that we're racing in. I think we just got to keep our head down, keep working hard, and then no, I'm sure the results will come. Right, here's Stoffel van Dorn. I always love new tracks, love discovering them. It's still quite early in the season to understand which track suits us very well. So there's still a, a little bit of unknowns. Here's jean eric Verne, and he goes third quickest. The best may be a fifth place, the best may be a seventh place, and the best may be a win. The race is about to get underway. The fifth round of the championship. All five lights are on, and we go green in Cape Town. Coming across the line now to start lap 23. Cassidy leads, to Costa second, Burn third, Benestrats fourth. De Costa takes the lead of the Cape Town E3. Burn is right behind him, but at the moment, things just keep getting better and better and better. Jean-Eric Verne takes the lead of the E3. De Costa wants this, he's not settling, is he? Burn down to second, Fenestrat still running in third, but look at this! When you have a good race or when you podium is, is a great feeling, obviously. You know, we all work hard to achieve and, and that feeling you can't really beat. Once all the celebrations are done, everyone's already focusing on, on the next target because it's never one race, it's a, it's a full championship we're competing in and uh, you always have to do it over again uh, time after time.